Hi, my name is Pace, the Green Girls Food Guru, and you're watching Green Girls TV. TheGreenGirls.com Today we're going to make pomegranate braised tofu. But first, I want to talk about selecting the right kind of tofu. The soybean is among one of the most popular genetically modified crops because it's so widely used in a variety of different food products. Genetically modified foods disrupt the natural food chain and are widely unregulated, so it leaves a lot of room for pesticide use. So when you buy your tofu, just make sure on the back of the package that it says non-GMO. Soy is the plant protein that most mimics animal protein in terms of nutritional value. But how do we make tofu taste good? If you're anything like me, you want your food to be both healthy and delicious. Braising is mostly used to cook tough cuts of meat in liquid for a slow period of time to make them tender. But I like to use braising for tofu because it penetrates the flavor through the whole piece of tofu and keeps it nice and moist. So for today's ingredients, you'll need one pound of firm tofu, one cup of pomegranate juice, a quarter cup of soy sauce or tamari, which is a wheat-free soy sauce, and one clove of garlic crushed. So you want to take, this is a pound of firm tofu, cut it in half like that. Okay, and then you want to go across the other way. We're going for nice rectangular pieces here. And see how they're only about a quarter of an inch thick? Crush that clove of garlic, peel the skin right off. Now we're going to add our pomegranate juice. the tofu in the pomegranate marinade, cover it, put it in the refrigerator and let it marinate for about an hour. Our tofu is all marinated and ready to pan sear. So you want to go ahead and light your pan to about medium high and you can put your hand about an inch above to see how hot it is and you want it to be pretty hot before you add the oil. Any neutral oil, vegetable oil is fine. Um, I'm using canola oil, just a personal preference. Add about a tablespoon of oil to the pan and let it get hot. And you'll be able to see that the oil is hot because it'll start to ripple a little bit when you tilt the pan back and forth. So as soon as you put a piece of food down, you want to hear it sizzle. All right, let's start adding our tofu strips. Oh yeah. Got it. Get in there and do it quickly. Great. So let these brown on both sides. They're nice and crispy. Let's flip them over. All right. So we want them to get nice and crispy on the other side. And this will give it such an awesome texture. It'll be all juicy on the inside and crispy on the outside once we're done braising. So now we are perfectly browned on both sides. We are ready to put these puppies in the oven and start braising. Cover your dish. Follow me over to the oven. I'm putting the tofu in the oven at 350 for about 30 minutes. Mmm, smells good. So our tofu has been braising in the pomegranate juice for about 30 minutes, nice and hot and ready to play up. So we're gonna do something really fun here. I'm gonna take it and stack it on the plate. Take about three pieces. I think it's a good serving size. You can always come back for more. And it looks really nice and elegant. And people usually don't associate tofu with uh, such an elegant presentation, but we're gonna prove them wrong. Pour a little bit of the braising sauce on top so it pools around the tofu. And maybe garnish with a little cilantro or even some chives. And there you have your pomegranate braised tofu. My name is Pace, the Green Girls Food Guru, and you're watching The Green Girls TV. TheGreenGirls.com